Right, real quick uh, greenhouse update. I'm going to show you uh, the duckweed pond that we built inside of our uh, greenhouse and the water quality uh, since we've done that. It's been about uh, 10 days since our last update. Today is uh, September 9th. There we go. You can see the zucchini's doing very well. Some of our harvest. Deep water culture is doing good. We did some thinning of our uh, tomatoes. Really, really needed to. And uh, here's our water quality for the day. Everything looks really good. In fact, I'm going to increase the uh, food load a little bit for the 60 tilapia. There's our secondary filter. It also looks like we're going to need to add a little bit more BT. As you can see, there we go. The BT got that inchworm, but there's some inchworms around here that are just still going. So it's been about three, three weeks or so, and we need to take care of the uh, inchworm situation. This is the duckweed pond. <laughs> it's not very big, but it's full of duckweed that we harvested from the Mojave River. And as you can see, that's what we got. Some nice duckweed. Let's go give it to our fishes and see what they do. Here you guys. Oh, they like it. They get kind of shy when the sunlight's on them. But they'll eat that right up. Let's take another look at it. And that stuff's supposed to double its uh, volume about every four to six days. Put a little sunscreen on it just in case. And we'll take a look over here our temperature control system and our air system this is the day night controller it's connected to three uh, heaters two 300 watt and one 200 watt this is the air supply and the circulation pump we got a 1400 gallon per hour aquarium circulation pump it only runs on seven watts and then this is the uh, 600 gallon per hour air pump and then there's a backup underneath that's about 20 gallons per hour underneath here is also some old battery backups you can see here I hit the display there's three of them here so in addition to being off-grid solar it looks like we have an uptime of about two hours on the battery backup as well so hopefully everything will stay together. And let's go ahead and feed a little bit of our fishes here.
some of these guys are nice and plate sized. As soon as we get some breeders, we'll start harvesting fish. So that's it for the uh, aquaponics greenhouse and the uh, new duckweed pond in the Mojave Desert.